I'm going to India. Woo! So, I've just finished packing, as you can see from behind. I'm getting picked up by Kieran at half past four, and then I'm off to India for three weeks. The plan is to film as many vlogs as we can in India, so you guys can come with us. We're in the car on the way to Kieran's house, where I have to say bye-bye to mummy no, for three that's weeks. So bye -bye. No. That's so you right, Anya? Sorry! <laughs> you guys hear him? Good. Right, so we've made it to Heathrow Airport, Terminal 4. four. Is it four? Yeah, Terminal 4. Yeah, Terminal 4, and we're absolutely starving, so we're going to grab a bite to eat. And we're also going to officially welcome Kieran to the vlog. Guys, you're right, how you doing? <laughs> So we've just made it through customs in India and we've had a nice eight hour flight. And now we're trying to find... Who is it? No idea where he is. We don't know where he is. Kieran's dad's friend is picking us up from the airport and apparently he's here but we cannot find him yet. We found him! We did it! Hi. It's quite hot here in India. <laughs> We've been walking for like one minute now, we're both sweating so much. Man. So we've made it to Iski's apartment in Gugan, I think. I apologise if I pronounced that wrong. Uh, and we're just sort of relaxing now, we're gonna have breakfast uh, and then we're gonna go out. On the plane, I happen to be sitting next to a really nice guy called Stom and I. Uh, he is from Lucknow. I think that's how I pronounce it again. It was very nice and he listened to me talk about where I was planning to travel and he kindly gave me loads of pointers on where to travel in India and other things that I could go see that were slightly off the beaten track. I will definitely be going to see some of these places that some of my uh, mentioned to me. He also told me a very interesting fact that I didn't know that the population of Delhi actually more than the population of Australia. So just had a lovely breakfast with Anu and we're gonna go have a nap. So what a great first taxi ride and tub tub ride in India. We just our driver has just taken us off to some random place. Tensi doesn't know where we're going and uh, it's not great is it here at the <laughs> We've just made it to Cyber City, which is where we plan to go because there's a few bars here. We didn't mess around by the tuk tuk guy. The price of the cab is still only 76 rupees, uh, which is less than a pound. There's the exchange rate, I believe, at the moment it's 85 rupees at the end of the day. It's annoying, but not too bad. Not too bad. It's really good for uh, We're doing cricket here. What is your aim? What are you trying to do? May I go to the bike? What do you have to do? Start. What do you have to do? Yeah. Get that. You have to do six sixes in a row. Six sixes in a row for a Harley Davidson fight. Quite worth it. Kieran Fancy himself. Yeah. They, they don't believe you that you're going to win the Harley Davidson. Wait, 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 see. He's saying he's doing international, but he can't even put leg pads on. For six consecutive. You're atrocious. My mum can bat better than that. Struggling here. He needs a bit of help here. I think it's a lost cause. Jeez, 
that was scary. If you just get some pointers from me, you might learn how to play cricket. It's a joke, mate. You might learn how to play cricket soon. Ten to catch me. Oh, dear. We got told off. Oops. That's because I got him out. I wasn't filming, but I... I got him out. So when's our Harley Davidson car? <laughs> Kieran aka Cram uh, didn't do as well as he thought he would in the uh, cricket. I'm looking at him, looking at me. Claims it's because of the machine is broken, but I'm not not particularly sure that I believe that. It was one. broken though. Mm, maybe, maybe not. Okay, now he's claiming he broke it because he's that good. We all saw in the footage earlier he's not. Went around and had a pint and had a look at a couple of bars for the next couple of nights. And now we head up home so we can get up early and go to Redport tomorrow morning. Peace out.